I want to just put a nice little bend over the top of an obstacle here and um, my favorite way to do this would be to apply some heat to the conduit and bend it I could put a spring in there and massage it but I actually find it easier to do it this way I love these little heat guns I know it's not a, a heat gun per se but I don't own one of those, so I'll just use this sucker. It'll do the job. The trick to heating conduit without burning it is to never let the flame stop on the conduit. So what I'm going to do when I'm heating this is start with the flame off the conduit, run it along the conduit, and then off. Then we'll turn the conduit a little bit, start with it off, run along the conduit, and then off. The idea is that we never stop on the conduit because stopping on the conduit will give the time give time for the flame to overheat the conduit and burn it. Uh, the conduit, the flame is not going to hurt the conduit. It's designed to be um, melted and remelted. It's PVC, it's thermoplastic. Off, along, off, along, off. Notice that's starting to go a little bit floppy. Just give it a little bit of support, heat it up some more. Now I want that good and hot, and as you can see, it's a little bit squishy. Now I can slide a spring down the center of there. That'll make it go cold fairly quick, and I can just set that over the top. Now because I put a spring in there, that'll help the conduit maintain its shape, it won't decrease its diameter and it'll also uh, cool the conduit, that's already hard because the spring itself has sucked the heat out. Okay, and we have a perfect set. Hi George.